Compromise is not the same as sacrificing your own needs or values. Compromise involves finding a middle ground where both partners can have their needs met, rather than one partner always giving in to the other. Research has found that couples who can compromise and work together to find solutions to problems are more satisfied in their relationships and experience less conflict. However, compromise may not always be the best solution in certain situations, such as in cases of abuse or when compromising would compromise your values or safety. Hello, and welcome to The Love Navigator. I'm your host, Airless, and today we're discussing compromise's role in a healthy relationship. Compromise is an essential part of any relationship. And it's important to be able to find a balance between meeting your own needs and the needs of your partner. In this video, we'll look at the necessity of compromise in a good relationship and some strategies for implementing it. Understanding the importance of compromise. Compromise is essential in any relationship because no two people are exactly the same. We all have our own thoughts, feelings, and needs, and it's important to find a way to balance these with our partner. A compromise allows us to work together and find solutions that meet the needs of both people in the relationship. The Role of Communication in Compromise Good communication is essential for compromise to be effective. It's important to be able to openly and honestly express your thoughts, feelings, and needs, and to listen actively to your partner's perspective. This can help to prevent misunderstandings and find mutually beneficial solutions. Tips for practicing compromise in a relationship. Here are a few tips for practicing compromise in a relationship. Seek to understand your partner's perspective. It's important to try to see things from your partner's point of view and to consider their needs and feelings. Practice active listening. Active listening involves fully focusing on what your partner is saying and trying to understand their perspective. This can help to prevent misunderstandings and find solutions that work for both of you. Be willing to give and take. Compromise involves being willing to give and take and finding a balance between your own needs and the needs of your partner. Be open to trying new things. Sometimes, compromising can involve trying new things or stepping outside of your comfort zone. Be open to these experiences and see them as an opportunity to learn and grow together. The Benefits of Compromise in a Relationship There are many benefits to compromising in a relationship, including Improved Communication and Understanding Compromise can improve communication and understanding between you and your partner. As it requires actively listening to each other and seeking to understand each other's perspectives. Greater sense of partnership. Compromise helps to create a sense of partnership and teamwork in a relationship. As it involves working together to find solutions that meet the needs of both people. Stronger Bond and Connection Compromise can strengthen the bond and connection between you and your partner, as it involves trust, respect, and a willingness to meet each other halfway. It's important to recognize that compromise is not a one-time solution but an ongoing process in a relationship. As circumstances and needs change, so may the compromises that are needed. Some common areas where compromise may be necessary in a relationship include finances, household chores, intimacy, and social activities. Finally, it's worth noting that compromise is not the only factor in a healthy relationship. Other important elements include communication, trust, respect, and a shared sense of values and goals. I hope this video has provided some insight into the role of compromise in a healthy relationship. Thank you for tuning into the Love Navigator.